So I'm fresh off my morning routine and I wanted to describe to you what I do every single morning to make sure that not only do I get some me time during my day as a busy working mom, but also I start my day fresh, centered, calm, and with a pretty positive outlook as a result. I used to just wake up and head straight to the coffee machine to make my coffee. And I decided to switch things up not too long ago and actually come straight into my quiet place, which is my office, and go into a 45 minute meditation. I switch it up sometimes and just do 20 minutes, maybe if I'm running a little bit behind or a little bit late. And right now I'm really loving the Joe Dispenza meditation. So that might be something that you look into. 45 minutes of that, 20 minutes minimum every single morning. And then once I'm finished with that, in order to amp up my mindset and get myself in the place of the future goals that I want to achieve, I use a tool called Mind Movies. And it's a really cool tool that you use to make a visualization video. And you can just look it up on mindtools.com. So I watch my mind tools visualization of what I want my future to look like. And that's like a three minute video with some great music behind it. And then after that, I get out my mirror. And I wanna go into a little bit of explanation about the mirror because this is probably the part that freaks the most people out. People have heard a lot about meditation, a lot about mental rehearsal, maybe not so much about using this mirror and looking into the mirror and telling myself that I love myself every single morning. And I use it a lot with my clients. And the reason I continue to use it is because it definitely works. If you've heard of Louise Hay, this is one of her books here that really goes into the whole purpose of the mirror work. But the idea is if we start to really love and forgive ourselves and find that soft place in our heart for ourselves, we'll not only heal our relationships with ourselves, but we'll actually start to heal relationships with other people. I had a really profound experience of healing a relationship that was a difficult relationship for me for years. And now I can honestly say when I'm around that person, I feel completely at peace, completely neutral. And it's all from just looking in the mirror every single morning and telling myself that I love myself and I forgive you. So literally what I do is I hold the mirror out and I say, Adair, I really, really love you. Adair, I love you and I forgive you. And I have several other affirmations that I might use on occasion and if there's certain people in my life um, that I want to make sure I'm keeping a soft heart for I tell them that I love them and I forgive them and it's just a really great place to feel the self-love for myself and also heal relationships because it definitely works so I do that for about five or ten minutes and then typically what I do is I go to my journal and I write gratitude and really anything else that comes up. Sometimes I like to write to my intuition, just anything that makes me feel more calm, more centered, and more at peace with myself as I'm starting my day. Since I do have two toddlers and I work full time, working on two businesses right now, it is uh, a lot. And this is the one time a day that I can guarantee that I have time for myself. So you may be asking, what time do I actually get up? Well, any time between 4.30 and 5 o'clock generally, kind of depending on what I have going on for the morning. And um, I can tell you it wasn't easy at first, but now I've routinized it and I can't imagine not having it as a part of my life. And as a result of doing this, I've been very consistent with this for the last, I think I missed one day of meditation for the last about 100 days now. I, do, I can see my life starting to shift and change. I can see my mindset really be different. Things don't bother me like they used to bother me. Um, I'm very good at turning things over to a higher power, God, the universe, whatever you want to call that, and just allowing things in my life. Um, because I've put my intention out there, my intention is clear, and so my intention with the meditation is just to have that good energy and that good elevated emotion that's going to draw my intended result back to me in the end. So maybe, some, maybe you just want to start with one thing, just try it out. Even 10 minutes of meditation and 10 minutes of gratitude will drastically shift your life and then you can build it up from there.